Hi, good evening, everybody. I am Grace. I'm one of the speakers tonight. I hope everyone is doing well and staying safe at home. I would like to show you a video. It's short of it. You can see an overview of what we've done. So before we go any further, please ensure that you're connecting to a Wi-Fi with good signal. Uh, please turn off your video setting. Please turn on your audio setting as the example shown next to this. No photography, no video or audio recordings are allowed. Thank you. So let me get going. So vSchool, um, www.vschooltrend.com is our main website. Vkidstrand, you can see our business license number there. And we stand by these four core values, which is um, number one, always exceeding expectations. Number two, continuous improvement, which I personally have seen their programs changing for the better every year. Number three, we listen, we care, we serve. Number four, we believe in people and their dreams un and under their leadership, and vision, you will see that they do their very best to, to lead. They do their best, really. Um, as many of you have heard that this is an internet-based education business company, which provides a platform for Malaysian students ranging from preschoolers to form five. Uh, we believe that education is a fundamental need. Everyone should have access for higher education. So let me explain to you further. And before that, I want I would like to introduce to you this exceptional management team. So Dr. Vivian Kerr, she's the CEO and founder. Dr. Denise Lim, the MD and co-founder. Dr. Eric Ang, COO and co-founder. And all of them have over 10 years of experience in e-learning education platform. To make things clearer, Vickets Trend is our company name and vSchool Trend is our learning program. And then we have our top V Kids Trend ambassador leaders. They are leaders that will train and will, will work very hard to guide us to reach our goals. Our company has won numerous awards like Business Award by Tengku Lapsamana, Asia Top Awards, Asia Pacific Top Excellent Awards. V Kids Trend has also won the Brand Laureate SME's Best Brands, you know. Um, winning alongside companies like uh, Public Bank and Cellcom. So in 2019, Vicky's Trend also won another award called um, Golden Bull Award. And we would like to congratulate our management team, you know, that in 2020, Malaysia's best, they won Malaysia's best consumer's choice brand award. That's amazing. 
So we do see an education, a, a tr um, the education trend being changed. No longer do we see um, children with so, ma so many books in their, and heavy bags that much anymore, but more like they are so into um, online education. As you know, this year and last year, there's mainly students that go online to, to learn their tuition, to go to school through online. So things have really changed. So with just a browser, parents are able to log in with their user ID. Ch uh, students will have their separate student, uh, student ID as well. So parents are able to log in from anywhere, anytime to check on their children's progress. So this program is based on school syllables suitable for UPSR, PT3 and SPM students. We have a lot of unique features and these are just some of it. So things like notes, a video, exercises, evaluation and report card for the parents, KBUD, uh, reward dictionary, which I will explain to you much further, essay, top 100, 2D to 3D animation, I think mind map, and then we have motivational words, instant marking, intelligent subjective questions. So for the I think KBUD features, we have a lot of colorful notes interesting, attractive video learning based on specific topics and video flashcards, especially for standard one and two. And my favorite picture dictionary where, where students learn vocabulary words through visual dictionary according to the syllables. So we have grammar with video learning in all three languages. So this is an example of all the colorful notes that we have, some of them. Let me show you an example of this simple ambassa. Simple ambassa. Simpulan bahasa ialah rangkai kata yang mempunyai maksud yang berlainan daripada perkataan yang membentuknya. Mandi kerbau. Mandi tidak bersih. Berat sebelah. Tidak adil membuat keputusan. Ulat buku. Orang yang suka membaca. Ikat perut. Menahan lapar kerana berjimat. Kaki bangku. Orang yang tidak pandai. This is another one as well. Just a quick preview. A lot of it comes with videos. That is a crocodile. Crocodiles have scales while humans do not. This is a mouse. The mouse is smaller than a human. Those are two birds. The two birds can fly while humans cannot. That is an elephant. Elephants are larger than humans. Those are whales. Whales can live underwater, but humans cannot. The sun is a star, not a planet. Mercury is the smallest planet. This is an example of the subject history, and you know that it is um, key subjects to pass SPM. So the notes are presented in forms such as mind maps and point forms. It's arranged, arranged in such a way that students can understand and memorize better.
And a lot of the notes, you can download it to read it offline or print it out too. Okay, so the picture dictionary, by the way, it, this is first in Malaysia. So it's provided uh, for primary schools and in three languages. Another important subject, math. The good thing is that there are solution steps to help them, to guide them, so that they can compare their answers and learn from it. So exercises includes HOTS, KBAT, you know, the Kamahiran Bufikir Arastingi, high order thinking skills and I think format. Then the evaluation, there are there are sample model question papers. Report card is for parents to review the students' performance. And there's essay writing with samples and intelligent marking system, which I will show you pretty soon. Okay, these are all the various formats that we have, which is objective, subjective, mix and match, drag and drop, fill in the blanks, look at the picture and answer, rearrange the sentence, tick the answer, circle the right answer, and media quiz. Uh, these are the media exercises. Good morning, Dad. Good morning, Ben. What day of the week is today? Today is Wednesday. What day of the week is tomorrow? Tomorrow is Thursday. Okay. These are examples of subjective format questions. So essays, they have examples for them. This is just to let you through that there's so many available, so many essay samples available. Oops. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the comprehension exercises comes to pronunciation. So for those um, children that do not know how to read or I mean, they're slow in reading, this will definitely help. Nama saya Simon. Saya berumur tujuh tahun. Saya dilahirkan dalam sebuah keluarga yang bahagia. Ahli keluarga saya ialah datuk nenek, bapa ibu dan kakak. Datuk dan nenek sangat sayang pada saya. Let's show you that Mereka... example. Let's go over here. So the instant marking, the moment they do it, they will they, it will be marked for them instantly. And it comes with motivational words as in like whether it's bagus or you know even though it's wrong. They say pretty nice, motivating. Betul. Have a look. Bagus. Hey, but it is to encourage the children as they. Jawapan salah. Sila cuba lagi. Ask them to try again if it's wrong. So that is really good to encourage the children that way instead of you know putting them down, but lift them up okay then this is a very uh, special feature online dictionary that's incorporated in so um, students do not need to have an external gadget for a dictionary or or get out of the program just to search for the meaning of the words they do not know so this is Camus pro dictionary this is how it's done just by highlighting and copying in Yeah, you can see it can be from BM to BC, Bahasa Melayu to Bahasa China, and then so forth. Okay, then we have a detailed report card for the parents to see so, they, that, so that they know what they're doing. 
Yeah, this is an example of how it's shown, how it's done. Even shows how much time they spend on a particular work exercise. So this is the newest thing, preschool learning program. So um, yeah, it's according to the KSPK and S71, KSSR syllables. Also comes with grammar, textbook, and assessment. These are some of the examples. Really colorful and nice, yeah? So textbook notes that, that comes with video learning. At school. Andy and Sally are seven years old. They are studying at SJKC Taman Indah. They gather at the school foyer every morning before going to their classes. Andy and Sally are classmates. They study in the same classroom. They conduct science experiments in the science lab. They have computer lessons in the computer lab. During the assembly, they gather at the school hall. The principal gives a speech on the stage. During recess, they go to the canteen to eat. Andy loves to go to the bookshop to buy stationery. Okay. So for the preschoolers, those are very helpful for the video learning and their storytelling as well. The goose with the golden egg. Once upon a time, a man and his wife had a good fortune to have a goose which laid a golden egg every day. Lucky thought they were, as soon began to think they were not getting rich fast enough. They imagined that if the bird is able to lay golden eggs, its insides must be made of gold. And they thought that if they could get all that precious matter at once, they would get mightily rich very soon. So, the man and his wife decided to kill the bird. However, upon cutting the goose open, they were shocked to find that its innards were like that of any other goose. Yeah, I hope you like that story. So with that, I would like to um, let you know that we have a lot of acknowledgement and appreciation from schools and from parents. We have also uh, we also get invitations to conduct seminars to the local school teachers on our program. So why this school trend? So most of these points I've already gone through. Just want to highlight uh, point number 17 that it's more than 600,000 questions in the question bank. So it's, they're always adding on as well. And we change as the school syllables change, we also change according to it. So nothing to worry about. And the best part is, most of you probably know coming in early that this program is only 388. It's like 110 per day, 30 RMG2 per month for all subjects. Very reasonable, isn't it? So these are some of the pictures to show you. Uh, top 20 students where this school awards the top 20 students. These are some of the testimonials on how she's, she was um, at the 31st place. And after using the V-School Trend program, she, she has gone up to sixth place. Yeah, and same for this boy, your jet as well from three. Just have a look. So pictures of all the lovely children that loves V-School Trend. 
So here comes to the end of my sharing. So this part, I'm going to be passing over to um, the next speaker. So I thank you for your time. Bye.